I will be performing an excerpt from the play Laughing Wild by Christopher Durant. Oh, it's all such a mess! Look at this mess! My hair is a mess! My clothes are a mess. I want to talk to you about life. It is just too difficult, isn't it, to try to just function and keep going. There are all of these people to deal with. Yeah. I tried to buy a can of tuna fish at the supermarket the other day, and, and there was this person standing right in front of where I wanted to get out my tuna fish. And I waited a while to see if they'd move. But they didn't. Okay, and you, you, they were looking at every can of tuna fish and reading it like it was a book. A really long, boring book, if you ask me. And, and nobody has ever asked me about that before, and maybe they should have. So I waited a long while, and they still didn't move. And I couldn't get to the tuna fish cans, but they seemed so stupid to not just have sensed that I needed to get by, that I had this awful fear that I would do no good if I asked. No good at all. They'd probably say something to me, like, well, move and we're damn ready, you witch. And then what would I do? <laughs> and so I started to cry out of frustration, quietly so as not to disturb anybody. And still, even though I was softly sobbing, this stupid person didn't grasp that I needed to get to the tuna fish. People are so insensitive. I just hate them. <laughs> and so I reached over with my fist, and I brought it down on his head, and I said, would you kindly move, butt face? <laughs> And the person fell to the ground, and he looked totally startled, and some child nearby started to cry. And I was still crying. And I couldn't imagine making use of any of that tuna fish now anyway, so I stared and shouted at the child to stop crying. I mean, it was drawing too much attention to me. And I thought, I ran out of the supermarket, and I thought, I will take a taxi to the Metropolitan Museum of Art so I can be surrounded by culture and not Tuna fish. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Kitty Newton, give a hand for Kitty Newton. Uh,